Hi you guys, this is Carmen from Connect, or Learning to Connect with Angels, and I've wanted to share this with you guys for quite some time, and I finally got around to doing this. There are two options on how you can do this. Actually, there's three. So what I went ahead and I did, this is my bed, and what I do is this is where I like to come and balance my chakras. So what I did is so that I can get the colors and the reason I have my light off is so that you can see the colors because if the light was on it would dilute or fade the colors. So th this is what I do is I created my own color therapy lamp or my own chakra lamp. And if you look at the color therapy lamps they're very expensive. I think they run like $2,000. So what I went ahead and I did is I created my own. So you can, if you have a canopy bed, or if you can create like a stand with PVC pipes, you can make your own. And this is what it looks like. And um, what I did is I bought these little lamps. I think they were like $5.95 each at Walmart. And I connected them to a PVC pipe. And it goes on my bed. But if you don't have a canopy bed, that's fine. Don't worry about it. If you want to make this, you can uh, buy a PVC pipe and then a connector. So that way you can do like a, like a, like a stand. So you buy other uh, PVC pipes. So you can do... The, the feet so you can lay underneath there now if you don't want to do that what you can go ahead and do is buy an individual lamp or in floor lamps and they do offer these they're like little desk lamps that you can buy and they're about the same about the same price uh, you can get more expensive ones if you'd like and the neck is very flexible and you can just go ahead and point the light to where you want it to hit. So let's say if you didn't want to buy the PVC pipe, you can just go ahead and buy the desk lamps, align them on the floor, and the next move, so you, um, what you do is you move the neck so it hits you the appropriate chakra. So what I do so that I hit the appropriate chakras here is what I do is I put a remote control because I'm in my bedroom and there are my remote controls and those are my, um, I guess, my points. And what I do is I put one of the remote controls where my head is, another one where my neck falls, another one with my heart falls, and another one where my root chakra falls. So I put the remote controls as a marker so that way I know where the root chakra is going to fall and then I know that right above it is the orange color then the yellow and then I follow where my heart would fall then where my throat would fall and so that's how I do the marker so let's say if I want it to align the the um the lights is I lay down and right next to me I place the remote control and I say okay this is where my root I align it next to me and then this is where my heart chakra falls right here so I know that when I'm doing the lights I have to make sure that the green light hits there and the root light or the red light hits there so then I know how do I align them and I do the same thing with my head I place a remote control where my head would lie say so, okay so that's what I do and it's so that I can balance my chakras so I lay down and you can see the beautiful colors. I do it according to the chakras. So there we have the violet, or you can have white. Then I have the indigo. Then I have the blue, green. There's the yellow. I use the warm yellow because when I use the cool yellow, it looks um, green. So the warm yellow. And then there's the orange. And then there's the red. Even though they don't look like they align here, 
they do align on my body as the light's facing me down. So you can do the same thing. On the ground, you put the desk lamps on the ground and you use a marker as I had done where I lay down where I'm going to be laying down and then right next to me I use the marker of the remote control. You can use pencils or you can use little strips if you'd like and then say okay this is where my root chakra falls, this is where this, this, that way you shine the lights there. Now what you can also do is buy the LED lights and I buy them for about five dollars at Amazon and I buy the LED lights with the remote control and this is the remote control that I got with it and the, each one comes with their own individual remote control and so you can choose the colors that are on here and um, for example if I just had one lamp and I wanted to work on all my chakras I can just go ahead and hit the remote control on and use this and it'll tell what it'll do well actually if I use this one it'll start blending the lights it'll go from red to orange to yellow to green to blue to indigo and violet to white and then it'll start all over again on its own as I'm doing my chakras or if I just had one lamp and I just want to work on my root chakra I turn it on and I put red and I face the light and I breathe in the light breathe in the color and I also pretend that not only am I breathing in my the color through my nose but I'm breathing in the color the light through my root chakra through the appropriate chakra so that's what I do and so if I was to work on the sacral, then I would change the color to orange and do the same thing if I only had one lamp. But if you're like me and you've bought, little by little I bought the lamps, I didn't buy them all together. What I first actually started is, I started I think with like three or four. And so I started with the root and I would do red and then I would place the yellow where my sacral chakra is so I would allow the red and the yellow it automatically in between creates the orange color so that's what I started doing and then of course I would put the blue and so the yellow and the blue in between would create the green color that's how I started it and then little by little started I when I could buy another lamp and another light bulb the light bulbs come from China or you can buy the color light bulbs. They're really expensive if you buy the color light bulbs and you have to make sure that you look at the wattage. I don't think the wattage could be more than 45. So the LED lights are like 3 watts. And I don't have to worry about if one of them burns out. I can always use one of the other ones and change the color. That's the convenience of the LED lights. And I really like the idea, and I wish I would have done this before I went ahead and I bought the PVC pipe. Is uh, I wish I would have bought the desk lamps, and so whenever I want to meditate, just lay the lamps in a straight line on the floor, and I just lay down and place the colors according to my chakras and just breathe it in or if you do what I do is I fall asleep with the colors and I actually do feel my chakras that this does help the chakras you could also place a color if you want to do like uh, make it powerful is put the appropriate color so let's say I'm not only am I breathing in the red light but I'm also putting a red shear or a red scarf or a red handkerchief where my root chakra goes and you could even place a uh, the crystal that's associated with it and listen to meditation or fall asleep do a chakra balancing meditation you can go ahead and do that so I'm also gonna lay on here so you can see what it looks like uh, but I really love to see the colors as I'm laying down and doing the meditation. But I wanted to share this with you because 
Uh, ever since I heard about color therapy, I was so interested in it, but I couldn't afford the expensive color therapy lamps, and so I wanted to share the alternative with you guys. And so I'm just going to show you what it looks like when I'm laying down. And uh, I'm also going to show you if you, let's say, if you run out of the batteries and you can only turn one light at a time. What happens is because all the colors are so close to each other, what will happen is if I try to change one color, they're all going to change because it's picking up the signal. But I figured out a way to change the colors. I first align the, I, well, what I do is I first choose the colors, then I align it. That's what I do. So I'm just going to show you what it looks like and then I'm going to show you how I do to change the colors so that there's no interruption with the control and then it changes so it won't change all the colors. So let me just show you what it looks like when I'm laying down. Hopefully you can see what it looks like as I'm laying down. And I'm meditating and breathing in the colors so that I'm able to balance my chakras. As I lay here, I can actually feel my chakras spinning. So it does help with balancing your chakras. This is what I mean by the interruption, okay? So even though I'm pointing it here, when I hit red, this one, and possibly the third one is going to change. See? They changed. So to avoid that, i say they're both red. This is why I choose the color first before I align it. I'll move this and then hit orange. And then put it where I need it. There we go. So that's how I do it so that they don't get affected. I first, I just move it away and change the color so that I'm able to change it. So let's see, let's try it again because I don't know if it may have gotten it or not. So let's say, see, let change this one. Let's see, let's do it orange. It changed this one orange. See how I did? It, it'll do that either. It'll pick up one or two. So I, what I can do is go back to the red. It changed both of them red. Move this one away. And then click the orange. And now the only one affected was that one. The whole reason I choose the LED lights is because of the wattage is three. And one time what I did is I actually got a light bulb and it started melting one of the lamps. So you have to be careful. And that's why I suggest the this one with the wattage. So I hope this helps you guys. If you want to create your own color therapy lamp so that you can go ahead and meditate. I hope it helps. And um, for some reason it has a three star on it. Um, Amazon. I don't understand why it has a three star. These work great for me and I've ordered so many of them for my chakra meditations. So I hope this helps you guys in um, balancing your chakras and once again I want to thank all my subscribers. You guys mean the world to me and uh, thank you for all of you who do subscribe and watch my videos. Thank you so much. You guys take care. Bye.